In this video, I will explain to you the difference between starting the electric motor in paramentant and momentary mode. Here we have uh, the power circuit and the common circuit of the electric motor in paramentant mode. In the paramentant and momentary mode, the power circuit is the same. It means uh, that all the elements are the same and there is uh, no difference. Uh, but the common circuit is different. Um, when uh, you must, uh, when you want it to bind momentarily, we have to remove this part. This is the electricity from the fuse and the pulse control and bimetal uh, reach uh, the stop K. After the start, it reaches uh, the conductor coils, and this part should be bleed to to start an uh, engine instantly. If you want to start the engine Experimentally, you must uh, connect 13 and 14 contactor with 13 and con 14 start case. We will uh, show with you the board now. We wired the power circuit with the grade 4 wire, but we wired the common circuit with wire number 1. We connected 13 of the, this K to 13 contactors and 14 K to 14 contactors. That is, if you only want these 13 and 14, the engine will be working standly. Uh, that is, when you hit the start key, the engine starts, and when you turn off the key, uh, the engine turns off. The paramount mode starts the engine by pressing the start key once and turn it off uh, with the stop key. So, if we want to change uh, the motor from momentary to paramount, we open uh, two three conductors, uh, 13 and 14. In this case, the step is uh, instant use. Now, if we press the start button, the engine will start, and uh, when we take our hand off, they started, the engine will start. The circuit, uh, the common circuit is similar to the previous mode, only 13 and 14 are removed. That means uh, you have to delete this part. Uh, if you delete this part, the engine will start instantly. If you add this section, it will be start permanently. Well, now we want to test uh, this circuit. We will uh, we electricity the string circuit and we connect the power circuit in the common circuit. By using a starter, we started the circuit paramount mode because uh, 13 and 14 contactors are connected. Uh, we can reset using stop. When we press the start key, it means it remains the in paramount mode. When we press press the stop key, it goes out of paramount mode and the engine turns off. Now suppose uh, we want to remove 13 and 14. We wait uh, to be on stand use. When we remove the it the hand, it becomes in stand use. If we, we connect this contact. It becomes paramount in this way. Okay. And uh, if we connect, uh, we must uh, disconnect using a stop. And if uh, it is not connected, activate and deactivate circuit instantly. When uh, it is not uh, connected, the circuit works momentarily. And uh, when it is connected, the circuit works permanently. For a moment, uh, remove this part from the circuit. This can also be done using the selector key. You saw how it was uh, launched uh, with the thumb key. Well, we give uh, this uh, explanation about the starting engine 
instantly and permanently. You have uh, also seen the work test. In this part, uh, I will tell you more about this setup. Thank you.